Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be doing a status update of my game I'm making and I'm very 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 much in the need of people to test the game to make sure everything works in its current condition and you will be you'll be very privileged because you will be able to test the game before it's actually released and tell me if you like it and tell me what things you would like to be changed or things that are unbalanced and potentially affect the outcome of this game so if you would like or are interested in testing this game leave a comment in the box below and uh, I will message you on YouTube the download link for the current version of this game um, okay so now some things I've changed since the preview video that I posted um, I have added a new skin for the menu system I have added a credits tab for all the people that have helped me out with the project um, but mainly this is completely the story and I'll, like the layout of the maps and all the all the hardcore stuff that is all the stuff that I've made um, music is mainly not made by me the music the music I am very thankful for the people that have made the music and they're they're pretty awesome and the music's very good and it really makes the, the theme of this game st stand out a lot more and I would play it but you unfortunately I, I, you cannot adjust the volume on my game. You have to do it on your actual computer. And when recording on Fraps, if you do not know, it doesn't matter what you have the volume on your computer set as. It'll just record really loud. And it doesn't work out well with this headset. So you can blame it on my headset. But uh, maybe at the end, I'll, I'll play some of the awesome music that's in the game. Anyways, uh, I also redid the combat interface and made it much more uh, aesthetically appealing. Okay, so here's the game. Um, here's the sprite for the main character. Um, in in here, uh, I'll tell you a little bit about the a little about this area. This is the first area I ever built in the game. So there's a little bit of there's some stuff that doesn't look that may look a little weird and stuff. Forgive me about that, but this is the first area I built. So, but pretty much every other area looks much nicer. But this area, you don't spend much time in this area anyways. So. Um, yeah, uh, and also I updated some of the stuff for the, uh, for the main quest, updated the dialogue, um, and for all the main characters in the game, I'm going to try to add a face set to the dialogue. Now, I'm not going to guarantee 100% that's going to be the case, but I'm going to try. Um, yeah. So... Um, let's go down here and uh, I'll show you a little bit of the combat interface that I've added. Um, let's go down here and let's walk around in a couple circles and find some slimes. Um, the actual, this walkway is here to help you um, on your first part of your quest because this, uh, this whole continent, this whole main continent here, this is the um, only the starting area. And the story gets much, much uh, more in depth once you leave this continent. Which, um, from, from testing, leaving this continent should take around half an hour. Um, that's that's about a good average if you've played RPGs before. Um, and here's the combat new the new combat interface. You have your face your face picture there. Uh, you have the name of the character with the fancy bar. You have your health below that, your mana below that. Those uh, darkened squares are for status effects that are currently on your character. And this orb right here will indicate mm, some other different things. You'll get the hang of it. It indicates uh, different health effects. So, yeah. And then let's go through the attack. And all the characters have it. <coughs> so you, the reason I added that is to get a little bit more used to seeing the characters in the party. Because before you didn't really see them all that often, so I added that in there so you can see them a little bit more and you can tell who is who. Um, let's go over here, and I'll show you a, a place uh, that was very nicely done. I think it's nicely done at least. This is the uh, one of the first villages that you can walk into. Um, you can go into all these buildings and you can talk to all the people. Um, I'm not sure if you can talk to all the people. I think I added. I think there's one guy in this, but nope, nope. You can talk to him. Wait, no, I was thinking of a different village. Sorry. There's too many places that I built in the last week. Um, but yeah, you can you can walk around. You can walk in this guy's farm, cabbage patch. 
Uh, I can talk to the, that lady. You can talk to this dude. Yeah. You can watch these butterflies. Um, yeah. Also, there is a shop system, and I recommend you use the shop system because I know one of my testers did not and suffered for it in, in the next continent. But you can go in here and you can buy all your stuff. Um, you can also sell stuff. There's nothing to sell because I don't have anything. Um, but yeah. Um, so this is a quick little uh, video of the game. Um, yeah. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else I really need to mention? Oh yeah. I gotta go mention something in this dungeon if you want to test it. Yeah, I do end up letting somebody test it. There's something important that you guys need to know. Um, okay, so in this dungeon, there is a hexagram on the ground, and you can investigate it, or you can not investigate it, it's up to you, um, but I strongly recommend you do not until I finish this game, because it's going to be the last thing I finish in this game, because that's what I'm going to, that's what I've told myself I'm going to finish last. Um, so do not mess with that, it will be finished, just you you won't be able to test it unless you're the last person testing this game before release. Um, but other than that, uh, all the main stuff in the quest, I mean, everything to beat, everything to beat the first part of the quest is here. Um, so you don't have to investigate it. That 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 hexagram has nothing to do with the quest. So, but um, oh my lord. Um, but yeah, so. You should have no problem beating the first first three quests. Um, what I need help with is actually the the next half of the, the game. I have not had anyone test the quests for the second half of the game on the next continent, which is the Eastern Kingdom, which I need somebody to test that for. But uh, other than that, this has been a quick progress report and uh, what I've been doing in this game and what I have finished. It's about 50% done right now with at least an hour and a half of gameplay. Um, this is going to be like a minor project. Um, well, not really minor. It's going to be a, a, a medium-sized game. It's not going to be like one of those super long, epic Final Fantasy 50 hours of gameplay because in order to do that, it would take me much, much longer, seeing as it's a one-man team of me working on this. And uh, But there are a couple people helping me out with music, and if I had to do music too, I, would, I wouldn't have this done. I probably would just not have it done. Which, by the way, for anybody who did the music in this game and is watching this, thank you very much. You really, really helped me out. Um, but yeah, so uh, in conclusion, I will uh, turn on the music for this game and so you can check out the new title menu music. Uh, but first, I want to tell you that the title... I don't know if I mentioned this before, but the title screen is only a temporary placeholder for the title screen graphic that I had commissioned. So... Uh, yeah, and the newest, the next version that I release is going to have the new title screen in it. But the one that you see in the background for the first menu screen is only temporary. But it, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna turn on the music and I'll leave you guys with the title screen music. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And I strongly do recommend you check out the music for this game because it's awesome. Um, you guys can check out when you test the game the credits for who made the music. And uh, yeah. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.